Today, we're diving deep into one of the most hotly anticipated mirrorless camera announcements in recent memory, the rumored Fujifilm X-T6. This isn't just another model refresh. This camera is poised to redefine what we expect from APS-C cameras. In today's video, we'll be unpacking everything from the leaked specs and rumored features to the surprising release timeline and projected pricing, which might make you completely rethink your current camera upgrade plans. The Fujifilm X-T6, a real game changer. Let's get one thing clear right from the start. The Fujifilm X-T6 isn't just an iteration. It's shaping up to be a revolutionary leap for the X-Series lineup. Leaks suggest that Fujifilm is doubling down on power, performance, and professional grade. Video features all while retaining the compact charm that made the series so beloved. According to insider sources, the X-T6 will house the 40.2 megapixel X-Trans CMOS 5HR sensor S. The same megapixel count as the X-T5, but here's where things take a turn. Instead of simply recycling hardware, Fujifilm is rumored to be optimizing the sensor for enhanced, low-light performance, cleaner ESO handling, and better signal processing. That means sharper images in challenging conditions and absolute game-changer for event. And street photographers dot processor upgrades, faster, smarter, more efficient along eyes the upgraded sensor. We're hearing that the X-T6 will debut a new image processor, either a re-engineered X-Processor 6 or a turbocharged version of the X-Processor 5. What does that mean for real-world usage? Improved autofocus response of Enisker battery efficiency faster burst speeds enhanced in camera. Effects and JPEG rendering in short. Whether you're capturing rapid-fire action shots or processing high-res video, the XC6 will have the horsepower to keep up dot advanced AI autofocus system. Perfect shots every time and oh. Let's talk about what might be the most exciting enhancement of all. The rumored AI-assisted autofocus system in the Fujifilm XD6. The leaks indicate a significant leap over the XD5. Introducing deep learning algorithms trained to recognize human faces, animal eyes, moving vehicles, and more even in cluttered environments. This is fantastic news for wildlife photographers, sports shooters, and even vloggers. The AF system is expected to track subjects across the frame with near unparalleled precision. Even in scenes with multiple moving elements, just imagine tracking a high-speed football match or a bird mid-flight and not losing focus that's the level of performance being teased. Cinematic video capabilities, ready for YouTubers and pros alike with XT6. Isn't just gunning for photographers, it's aiming to dominate the hybrid shooter market. Fujifilm appears to be pulling out all the stops with video capabilities that could rival some dedicated cinema cameras. Here's what's rumored colon internal 6.2000 recording at 30 FPS for K at 1 to 0 FPS. For ultra smooth slow motion 10 bit for to 2 to 2 internal color. Def potential pours internal support external raw via HDMI output of this pack into a camera body that's likely smaller and lighter than its full frame rivals. If this comes to fruition, it could be a dream come true for content creators, indie filmmakers, and YouTubers looking for a compact, do it all system, built in cooling system. Overheating has plagued mirrorless cameras in recent years, especially during extended 4K and 6K recording sessions. The XD6 may be the first in the XD series to include a built in cooling mechanism, possibly even a modular fan accessory like the one in Fujifilm's XH.S. This enhancement would make long form content creation much more feasible and reliable, especially for creators shooting interviews, documentaries, or live events. In body image stabilization, now up to eight stops. The current Fujifilm XD5 features seven stops of IBIS, but rumors suggest the XD6 might push that number even further to a remarkable eight stops of stabilization. This could allow for handheld shooting at shutter speeds as slow as one quarter of a second, which is practically unheard of in this segment. Whether you're shooting landscapes at twilight, handheld vlogging, or capturing slow shutter motion blur, this could redefine how and when you shoot especially for those looking to leave the tripod at home. Display and EVF enhancements will come back to Techno Trend Zone, your home for deep gear analysis and tech speculation. Let's talk ergonomics. Fujifilm might finally overhaul the traditional XD display system with the XD6, while some leaks suggest a fully articulating screen. Others point to a revamped three way tilt mechanism giving users more freedom for awkward angles without sacrificing structural integrity. On the EVF front, Expect a 5.76 million dot LED viewfinder with a refresh rate of up to 120 Hz. This upgrade brings the viewfinder on par with mid-tier full-frame cameras from Canon and Sony, delivering a seamless, lifelike preview with minimal lag especially useful when tracking fast-moving subjects. Color science and film simulations, more options, 
more creativity if you're a future film fan. Chances are you love their film simulation. Modes those classic, color-rich profiles that mimic Kodak, Fuji Color, and more. Rumors suggest the X-T6 will introduce new film simulations, along with real-time preview of color profiles, giving creators an edge when composing their shots with precise color grading baked right. In power management, same battery, better performance. X-T6 is likely to retain the NPW to 3.5 battery, but optimized power usage via the new processor means we could see notable improvements in shooting time, both for stills and video. This is crucial for wedding photographers, documentary filmmakers, or anyone on long shoots where battery swaps aren't ideal. Release date. The real surprise now here is where the narrative really twists out originally. Many predicted a late 2024 or early 2025 release for the Fujifilm X-T6 based on the brand's historical product cycle. But trusted industry sources are now suggesting a radically different timeline. The Fujifilm X-H3 or X-H3S, which hasn't even been formally announced, will launch before the X-T6. This means we're looking at a potential release window of late 2026 to early 20 to 7. Yes, you heard that right 2027. Why the delay? It appears that Fujifilm is investing extra time to perfect the sensor, optimize AI autofocus, and ensure the camera launches with the stability and performance users expect. Rather than rushing out a half-baked product, they're refining every detail to deliver a flawless, future-ready platform that justifies the weight, pricing strategy, high value at a competitive cost. Let's address the burning question. What will this beast cost? The body-only XT6 is expected to retail between $1,799 and $1,899, with the kit bundle priced around $1,099 to $2,199. This puts it slightly above the XT5, but still under the Pro-Tier XH-S, with its hybrid strengths. It's poised to compete not only with the likes of the Sony A7RV and Canon R6 Mark II, but also with some entry-level cinema cameras at a fraction of the cost. If you're a wedding, photographer, travel vlogger, or documentary filmmaker, this single body could potentially replace two or three separate cameras, making that $2,000 investment seem like a bargain. 